uh, we had a trial today. It's an appeal of uh, a ridiculous verdict of a woman I have never met. I don't know. I have no idea who she is. She wrote a book, and she made a ridiculous story up. She put it in her book. And we're now appealing the decision. We had an extremely hostile judge appointed by Clinton, very good friends of Clinton. I have no idea who the woman is, and I never met her. Now, I don't know about a picture that was taken 40 years ago with her husband on a celebrity line, so I don't think that counts. But as far as I know, I never met her. I never touched her. Uh, I have — I would have had no interest in meeting her in any way, shape, or form. There were two witnesses. One is a woman who's followed me for years. Uh, she said, in 1979, I was in an airplane with her, commercial flight, and we became very intimate. I just sat down. I, I think I had the book, The Art of the Deal. I was famous then, too. I've been famous for a long time. And we're sitting in first class, according to her. Never happened, by the way. Totally made-up story. She's a Clinton person, too, by the way. Big Clinton person. And she said, I was making out with her. And then, after 15 minutes, and then she changed her story a couple of times. Maybe it was quicker that I grabbed her at a certain part, and that was when she had enough. Now, so think of how the impracticality of this. I'm famous. I'm in a plane. People are coming into the plane. And I'm looking at a woman, and I grab her, and I start kissing her and making out with her. What are the chances of that happening? What are the chances? And frankly, I know you're going to say it's a terrible thing to say, but it couldn't have happened. It didn't happen. And she would not have been the chosen one. She would not have been the chosen one.